Hey everybody, a uh, quick video here on my home carbonation setup. You know, I use this to uh, carbonate water. Uh, I had a soda stream that I converted to paintball canisters, which I'll link a video to that. Uh, that worked okay, but um, you still have to refill the, uh, you know, the cans and it's, they're small, they don't last very long. Uh, so my new setup here, I've had about three years. Um, got a 20 pound CO2 tank from a CO2 distributor and got the uh, regulator and everything from them as well. Everything else in this video came from uh, Amazon, and uh, I'll uh, put links in the description so you can uh, check that stuff out. Uh, so this consists, of course, of our 20-pound uh, tank, our regulator. I think that's called an injection nozzle, the hose. Um, that all is like, you know, home brewing stuff for beers, what that stuff's actually sold under. But I will, like I said, link it in the description. Got our uh, stainless steel carbonation cap and our plastic uh, PET bottles, that they're called. So the way that this works here... oh. Also put a piece of, uh, it's a quarter inch inside diameter, three eighths outside diameter vinyl tube so it gets down into the water. Uh, you, you don't really need that, but thought it might help. I don't know if it does or not, but it's on there, so I just left it on there. So basically what, what we'll do here, uh, we'll screw this on. And I'm not gonna screw it all the way down yet because you, you do wanna get the air out of this if you can. So what I do is screw it down a little bit, start squeezing till water comes out. And I normally do this over the sink, of course. Take a towel, make sure it's uh, nice and tight. So we got it squeezed in a little bit here. And then our cap just uh, connects on. Yeah, set the camera back just a hair here. And what we're gonna do now is I'll go ahead and turn it on and watch the bottle here as it fills up. And then you're going to just shake it. You shake it upside down for about 30 seconds. All right, it should be nice and carbonated. So we're going to turn our uh, tank off, disconnect our injector. And now here's the uh, best part here. There's our carbonated water. And let me go ahead and uh, take the uh, carbonation cap all the way off here. And of course, from here you can put your uh, flavored flavors in or whatever you want to do. And uh, just you know, just check this out. Go ahead and pour the uh, carbonated water here. Here it's sizzling. And there it is. You can see all the uh, nice bubbles there. There's a uh, homemade, you know, carbonated water. And um, like I said, check out all the stuff on Amazon. And I also have a way too to take glass bottles, uh, fill them up with this stuff and actually cap them. And I can just leave them in the fridge and pop the cap off uh, when I want to drink one. And if anyone wants to see that video, drop a comment and let me know if uh, anybody's interested in that, I'll make a video on that as well. Uh, any questions or comments, I'll put them in the comments. And until uh, next time, we'll uh, talk to everybody later.